Alright, welcome back to my Pokemon Fire Red Walking Part 37. This is it, everyone. This is the, um, video where we will be fighting and catching the most powerful legendary Pokemon in the game. I'm sorry I don't have any sound on. <laughs> Alright, so, there was a guy who was standing right here, if you can see him, but now he's gone because you have to get, in order for this to be open, you have to get a Sapphire and a Ruby. So once you get the Ruby and the Sapphire, the guy will leave. Because in the original game, once you beat the Elite Four, you can come here after. But now in this game, you have to get the Ruby and Sapphire, and then you will be able to get here. So let's go in. Cerulean Cave. These, the Pokemon in here. Now I'm, I'm going to put up repels for some amazing, because I believe, yeah, that, you know, it's going to help, when it's not going to help at all. So what you have to do, is basically just be very careful because the Pokemon in here are very high level. If you're running to one, you probably won't be able to run away. Just go pick up any items I see on the way. So far, so good. I probably just jinx myself. So basically, take the way I'm going, I mean, you can, you know, explore the whole cave. But, this is how you get to the legendary Pokemon. Oh my god, first wild encounter. What is it? It's a Parasect. At level 64. We're not even level 64. Can we run? We can run, surprisingly. And our second wild encounter. Okay, so... This will probably be the area where we cannot uh cannot not run into wild Pokemon. We will run into wild Pokemon is what I'm saying. Because we are simply not high level enough. To make the repel work. Like, because my highest level Pokemon is 58, so only level 58 and below will not appear. But because the Pokemon are so high, there'll be little, you know... Oh! Wobbuffet. Okay, now we cannot escape no matter what, because... Shadow Tank. So this Pokemon is difficult because it cannot physically attack you. Or specially attack you, unless you attack it with a physical and or special attack. So, I'm going to go ahead and use Thunderbolt. Now, it's probably, yeah, Miracle. So, Miracle uh, reflects special attack damage back at you. And, uh, Counter reflects physical attack damage back at you. So, what I actually want to do, this thing is part psychic, so I will use Bite. Now, I am considering catching it. But I have no clue. Because I don't think I will, though. Because I don't, I don't think I'll have a problem with the next legendary Pokemon that we're going to catch after this one. Because I can just use my Master Ball, it's that easy. That's why you save your Master Ball, by the way. You save your Master Ball, don't use your Master Ball on Mewtwo or any of the birds. Because they're easy enough to catch with an Ultra Ball. Like, they're difficult, sure, but they're, you don't need to waste your Master Ball on that. See, I didn't know that because for the longest time, 
I always use my basketball on, uh, I probably spoiled it already, but we're facing me too. I mean, if you know, you know, you know? But yes. So, here we are. Okay, and because, um... Jolteon in... Guy. We're going to bring him back to life. So now, save. And now, let's pop the tune. Mew tune. It says Mew, but it's actually Mew tune. And if you don't know, Mew tune actually comes from Mew because a, sci a scientist that created it took the, um, Wow, I'm surprised it can go for a safeguard. It usually goes for a safeguard first. But as you can see, it's level 70, very, very high level. It probably won't be... Oh my goodness, that was a critical hit. Wow. It does no recover, so be careful with that, because that sucks if it recovers. Because it'll be super hard to catch. And Psychic is very powerful, so don't bring any poison, don't bring any fighting. But basically, um, it should be, uh, difficult for... I'm going to try to use Bite. I don't know if this will kill it. I hope not. No? Okay. Bite uses Recovery anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter. I thought I could get it in Color Red, but apparently not. So we use Surf again, it uses Psychic, and we live with 4 health. We use Bite, get it down the red, we we'll use Recover, and it flinched. Yay. <clears throat> so now we're going to use our Ultra Balls, and as you see I have a hundred and ten. Because this thing is very hard to catch, it takes forever, especially if it uses Recover. It, it, will gain health, which makes it even harder to catch. But our pack is lowing now, so Swift should do less damage. Wow. And it uses recover that, so it's great. Okay, so what I want to do is actually use flamethrower. And it uses psychic, kills us, of course. Basically, it only takes like one or two psychics to kill it. Or, or for it to kill us. So what we're actually going to do is we are going to use ice punch. Just a little bit. It uses a cover. That's okay. Not really, but because psychic won't do much for it to it. Ice punch will. It is paralyzed. Uh you not run. I was pressing all buttons. I don't think that another ice punch should kill it, but I don't want to risk it just in case it does. And as you can see, there we go, it's safeguarding. So any status inflections will not work. It usually does that at the beginning of the batch. But, oh my god. We caught it. Wow. That's insane. That's awesome. That's like, takes like forever to catch for me. At least any, every other Pokemon does. Like the legendaries, they take like a long time. I usually have to try to catch them like a couple days, takes me. Because I usually run out of Pokeballs and I try again and I try again and again. But yeah, we caught it. 
I'm obviously so surprised. I don't know if we have a. Uh, we do not. So we have to actually fight our way back to uh, Cerulean City, which sucks. Unless I think a Pokemon egg. <laughs> So, yeah, see, 67, that's, like, insane, you know, like, wow. Um, I think I will edit this, I have no clue. Because I just want to get out of here and get to the next video, and then I just want to end it. Because you could fight the, like I said in the video before, you could fight the Elite Four again. They will have stronger teams, different Pokemon. But honestly, you can look that up. Because, I mean, at first I didn't want to cover it, but now it's just, I don't want to fight them again. I don't want to train for them. I, I really don't. So, uh, uh, this will be like, I believe the second last video of this playthrough. So, we will, oh, wow, my fat goodness. That's just great. That's just great. We can use a hat, though. It can't do nothing to us. Ha ha ha. And we can use uh, Ice Punch. And Ice Punch again. So for Wild Effect, you could get one on like the Sevy Islands. It will be lower level. But basically, this Pokemon is great for catching the next Legendary, which will either be NK Suiku, Suikun or Raikou, Raikou, because its ability is Shadow Tag, which prevents any Pokemon from leaving the battle, and those three Legendary Dogs, another one with that, wow, and it's three more so a crap will work. Um, yeah, it's... Shadow ability, Shadow Keg ability prevents those Pokemon from basically uh, running away is because that's the thing, they run immediately after one move and, it, and they run um, they run if they're faster than you so, if you have a wall buffet at the start of your team, of course, I would not recommend getting one right now from here. I would get a lower level one from the Sevy Islands because, and, and I'll explain this in the next video as well. I'll, <coughs> I'll uh, recap it. But basically, you want to have a Pokemon that's level, any Pokemon. In your party that is level 49 or lower but higher than the pokemon level in the route that you're trying to catch in where i can't remember where i'm going i'm going to the right <laughs> so say if you're on like route i don't know two route two because um and i'll show you this in the video but, and I'll say it again, but basically, what you want to do is, like, like this is just for example, I mean, you'll see me do it, but I'm just saying, like, for right now. Up to, like, only super low level Pokemon, like Caterpie or Para, Caterpie, Wheel sometimes, uh, will appear on up to. So you use your max repel for a Pokemon, let's say, level, like, level 5. And then you should be okay 
I don't know why you went from that goal bat. I could have ran. I just chose to fight for some reason because I'm talking. Um, but basically, yeah, that's that's how you do that. Um, but like I keep saying, I'll I'll show you in the actual video. And oh my gosh, we're almost out. And of course, a Pokemon. Okay, Gold Duck has to interrupt me. Please let me get out. Oh, thank God. Okay, so. And this, and this trick works in any route that is like route 16, uh, route 6, like I said, route 2. Um, I believe route I don't know, but I'm gonna go to route two because that's the example I I talked about and and I find it to I you try route six or whatever route I just said was above uh, vermilion see because I also you try there but I find route two a little bit easier and better. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.